Hey guys, Keith from Helvonic Games. I'm going to show you the location of an artifact. I think it's called Artifact of the Guardian. But it looks like Artifact of the Gatekeeper, so I'm just going to check it out. I'm on the Olympus map, and my coordinates are 45.75. 40.09 and you want to be at the top of this mountain now, this mountain is the same location as where you get the rock drake eggs so if you go around the outside on the different ledges you'll find rock drake nests and rock drake rock drakes ready to kill you uh, if you're not quick enough uh, but on the top of the mountain there's this there's this ruin um, here and uh, you'll see inside the ruin there's uh, always at least one tech giga called the centurion and I don't have any dinos that can that can fight that. Um, I found that uh, you can pull the uh, pull these gigas outside, but as soon as you pull one outside of the the chamber, um, another one spawns inside. So it's a bit of a, it's a bit of a nightmare really to get this. But the artifact's literally right there. But if you get too close to that giga, it will aggro. So let's have a look, it's called, it says Loot Crate, it's actually the Artifact of the Gatekeeper. Okay, so on the Explorer map, it says Artifact of the Guardian, so alright, it's stopped. Uh, I'm just wondering if we can grab it and jump back on my, my team before it, uh, let's see if we can grab it without dying. There we go, so there you are, Artifact of the Gatekeeper. I'll, uh, what I'll do is I'll go out the side here, I'll put it into my, uh, I'll pop it on my um, little dude, and see if we can get another one, see if we can get the second one, it's moved a bit now, um, let me see if I can just get it to come over here, whoa, I don't want to be that close. <laughs> Just move it over here, see if it'll just gonna re aggro on me. Ideally, I don't want it to come out because the last one I dragged out, that's why there's two at the moment, because I dragged it out and then another one spawned immediately in the middle. So ideally I want it just on the edge there, as far as where as I can get it, but not outside. Oh, it's gonna get, it's gonna aggro and seed me. Once it's aggro it seems like it's uh seems like it's tough to get rid of aggro. Oops. Okay, it's going to come. So we'll maybe, maybe we'll jump that one off the edge and see what happens. If I maybe sat, if I sit down here. Okay, that one's gone and that one's not aggro. Well, it is aggro, isn't it? But, so that said, if I can do that, I might just be stuck behind there. <laughs> they're both trying to, they're both coming back in. I don't want it to come back in. It's interesting, once you've got aggro, no matter what you do, it seems to, the aggro seems to, to stay. Get it to jump off the edge then. Just drag him off the edge. That's my next plan. If I can actually, there we go, it's going to come. One off. Got a bit of lag there. <laughs> okay, they're both off the edge right now, but what I think is going to happen straight away is another one's going to appear in the middle. So that's what happened last time. So I'll tell you what, we'll grab this dead quick and hopefully one doesn't spawn on top of it. There is actually a uh, Interesting, I don't know why they've put a drone terminal there, but there is a uh, terminal for creating scouts and unassembled enforcers, in case you're wanting to do that, and that is uh, somewhere where you can do that. There's also a ton of um, uh, scouts there, if you want to actually get some engrams, see if it'll just gonna let me... Uh, attack these. No, I <laughs> just can't get close. Can't get close enough. Just stop, air break. 
No, they must be bugged and not, um, not allowing me to attack them. So I think because of its close, because of that one's closeness to the centre, it's not, it's not responding another one. So I'll see if I can uh, get it to come further down, get it to despawn, get it to come further away from the middle, and just see when I go back whether there's a another one. I did want to show you that, just so you know. Now I'm not respawning, so that's interesting. Maybe you only have to get rid of two. If you get rid of two of them, then you have an opportunity to grab the artifact. So that was um, that was an interesting test. Anyway, so we got artifact of the gatekeeper, and of course the scotch spike skin. And um, so that's it for this video. Thanks for watching Hellbound Games, and I'll see you again soon.